is Bonnie from Bonnie's Bargains, and today I would like to do a reading from Jesus Listens. Dear Heavenly Father, you tell me in your word that you are able to do immeasurable more than all I ask or imagine. So I come to you with positive expectations, knowing there is no limit to what you can accomplish. I confess, though, that I sometimes feel discouraged because so many of my long-term prayers are still unanswered. Please help me to wait patiently, trusting you in the midst of uncertainty. You have promised that those who wait for you will gain new strength and I definitely need more strength. Instead of letting difficulties draw me into worry, I'm trying to view them as setting the scene for your glorious intervention. You've shown me that the more extreme my circumstances, the more likely I am to see your power and glory at work in the situation. I long to live with my eyes and my mind fully open, beholding all that you are doing in my life. Thank you, Jesus. You know, um, I've gone through cancer and I've had a lot more difficulties in my life. And it's a hard road. It, it, it is a very difficult road when you're very sick or you're in pain or you're scared or it may be something that you can die from. And sometimes it's like, why me? Why is this happening to me? You know, just remember also that there are trying times and that the devil that Satan is still out there and everything that bad that happens in this world is not by God. So therefore, when bad things happen to you, trust in God and ask God for strength and keep your eyes on focus to him. There is something more powerful out there whether you choose to call it the universe or whatever your religion is, for me, it is God. But just remember, you got here, things happen for a purpose, for a reason, but then all things are not by God. Remember that. But it all comes down to, do you believe? Do you keep your faith? Do you keep it strong? Do you keep eyes on God? And do you pray to God and talk to God and say, I need help. I'm in pain. I hurt. I know when I got cancer, I said, I can't believe this is happening to me. I... And then I thought, what? Stop it. I'm the one that decided to get in the sun without sunscreen for years and years. And, you know, why not me? But then it's like when I started praying deep, really deep down on my knees, God just took it, you know. And at that moment, I just knew it was going to be okay. Was I scared? You bet I was. And I had to pray about that because I explained to God, I am afraid. So that means that deep down, I am not believing everything that you are going to give to me because I still have fear and doubt. And when I started realizing that, then everything started changing. But why does bad things happen to good people? 
happens every day, and sometimes it is not from God. So don't let other things keep you down. Keep your focus and keep your prayer. Wishing you a wonderful day, and remember to be in someone's clouds today. Be a rainbow in someone's